We're fine up here. Don't come up here. We're fine. Okay, now come up here. We're not fine. <laughs> We're not fine. <laughs> Welcome back. Hi. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Let me turn off the heater. <laughs> if not, I hope this makes your day a little bit better. Um, that's all I gotta say. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I I told you guys before the insomnia is kicking my butt. I did not sleep well at all. But <laughs> this is going to be a freaking uh late upload. So it's gonna be there. It's gonna be there late. Oh, uh, before I do anything, let me yeah, let me fix stuff. Oh god. This place looked exactly how I thought it would look. <laughs> it may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, tastes pretty, huh? the brother. <clears throat> Avi, meet the guys. Clint okay. runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones Howdy. are a bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Please to meet good? you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. I mean, no can't really complain, here. honestly. I'm not gonna say it. You guys have a way of doing things. Thank you. Yeah. We have to be careful. I'm sure you can understand. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent black forest gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi. Take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Yo, though. Spinach it, from Clint's look. garden or a baked delicacy by yours truly. I mean, it all looks Everything good. Everything looks but... so good. I, I want it all. So polite, David. You sure he's your brother? Can't trust a diplomat. Always saying one thing and thinking another. Please, I'm just make saying, yourself comfortable. It, it all looks good, but I'm going to choose the cake. <laughs> like, don't play. We value I have a sweet tooth like so crazy. Please, forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? Okay. The three of us and Dr. Lingard make all the decisions here. So, yeah. People who choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. Especially for the more independent-minded. There's no structure out there now. People get used to doing as they please. At this point, like, I don't even know what to say. You'll tell the line. He'll answer to me if he doesn't. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking ha. Huh? I helped him bring it back to life. We had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. I think. I think Wondering that's what this giant piece of body art is all about? It's our litmus test for loyalty. I've seen that mark a few times. You probably saw it at the gates. Right, Javi? No. We all took it as a sign of commitment. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We. We lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our they lives. They seem pretty nice, honestly. Protecting my people from that kind of pain. They just got a couple of bad apples in their out. group. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask, but I never want them to have to experience loss like that again. I know how you feel. Seeing the people I care about suffer, it's a terrible feeling. I just want to shield them from it all. It's a noble aim. One worth fighting for. Yeah. You got a couple of bad apples in your group. Max, what are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing uh... that can't be worked out. I want to hear that from Javi. I don't have a problem with him. He's all right by me. Yeah. 
Same here. I don't buy it. Max, how did this start? Go ahead, tell him, Max. Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. Go ahead, Max. Tell him. Tell him we what you did. siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? Answer her. Did you steal gas from us? I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. If you right. just asked, we'd have given it to you. That, that's not all. Rufus said Clementine ran his truck off the road just to break him free. Clementine? The girl we had trouble with in the past. You can always judge a man by the company he keeps. Okay. Well, then we, that girl, that's why no we judging y'all. I would say not. Well, let's judge you then. You got some colorful friends. So right. what if Javi met up with Clementine? It doesn't mean anything. We kicked her out for a reason, David. Now the two of them are thick as thieves. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to bandits. We're trying to build something different here. Something resembling civilization. Oh, for you know, God's sakes, get off your high horse. Don't pretend right. like your people don't have blood on their hands. I'm exactly. not sure what you mean. We hold our people to the highest standards. Since we uh, put in everything out there, let's put everything out there. Mm -mm. No, shut up, Dave. One of your people, some asshole called Badger, he put a bullet in a little girl, my niece, David's daughter. What? Damn it, Javi, I told you I'd handle it. No, David, this cousin fucking dirtbag has the balls to accuse me. He exactly. and Badger destroyed an entire town. That's Since enough. putting everything out there. No, we need to hear this. Go on, Javi. Sounds like you've got more to get off your chest. They overran Prescott with walkers, ran them in on trucks. Badger did that, not me. You were right there next to him. I tried to get him to stop, I swear. David, we warned you about getting your soldiers in line. We don't know all the facts. We know enough. She's right, David. You've lost control. I want them gone. All of them. Take Javi and everyone in the quarantine to the gate. Send them out with enough weapons to defend themselves, but no more. I'm cool with that. I wanted to leave in the first place. I wanted to leave in the first Look, place. we can't so fight we... this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here. Your doctor friend, too. But the rest of you, you're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. It's out of my hands. I don't even know what to say at that point. Just stay alive, okay? And the fact that you guys took their side just because they're in your community proves to me even more that you, where your loyalty stands. Because they should have been thrown out too. You're lucky I don't gouge your fucking eyes out with my thumbs. You hear me, asshole? I'm fine with this. We want to leave. We just want everybody to leave. And trust me when I say we're coming back for Kate now. David packed this. He did. They said... Start walking. What about Eleanor? Walk. Eat shit. Answer my fucking question. God damn it, Harvey! Let go of me! This isn't gonna help Eleanor. Don't make it worse for her. Did you really just get put down by a girl? Do not fuck this up. There's a settlement a few miles west of here. Don't come back. Trust me when I say we're coming back. We're coming to get Kate and Gabe and Eleanor. Did you really just get put on your butt? Get up! You, you make us look bad out here. 
Did you piss in someone's oatmeal back there? Thought you were gonna play along. We trusted you. Everything was going okay. At first. I don't know what happened back there. I know what happened. Yeah, well, I got a pretty good idea what's gonna happen out here. Let's just see what they gave us. Knowing them, it's probably a butter knife and a stick of gum. They could have just shot us more than once. Oh, how fucking neighborly. I mean, uh, I don't, like I said, I thought they were gonna throw us all out, including Maxim, but what's whatever. That? It looks like a map. I doubt they give one to everyone. Ava did say David packed the bag. Why the hell is it tied to a baseball bat? David's sense of humor was always poorly timed. All right. Looks like they're expanding. Some of these areas are marked clear. Okay. Okay. There's Richmond. That helps. But we can't go back there. Knowing where it is lets us know where we are. So I'm assuming that's where they want. He wants Pretty me to sure go. Pretty David wants us to go there. And if this is us here, then I think we can head along this path. Just gotta head north. All right. And Look. to find North, <laughs> we need to find the North Star. <laughs> Jesus. Je Jesus. First off, I need to know what we're looking at, but... <laughs> I mean, I know we're looking at the stars, and I know, like... Uh, short. Is that it? Uh, I remember something about it facing toward the Little Dipper. I don't know anything about the constellations, okay? There. The end of the Little Dipper. No. That's the Big Dipper. Of course it'd be the one in the middle. I'm just clicking them that's on it. at this point. Do you expect we people to know something way. about the stars? You know what? What Look, else is in there? If we not might a end whole up... lot. The flashlight. Not enough weapons. No food. If we're going to end up in a zombie apocalypse, we all need to study the stars, okay? And figure out which stars is Trip, come on. What's up? I can't lose anyone else. <clears throat> You're not I'm gonna telling lose you, I can't. You're not gonna lose Prescott, anybody. Prescott, Conrad, maybe Eleanor. We'll be okay. Knock that shit off, Trip. You're better than that. <laughs> we'll see. <sighs> Sorry, man. Rough day, to say the least. You I are better than that. You're you strong. Got my back. And I got yours. Of course. After you. Uh, well, let's go. I honestly didn't want to be there in the first place. I just wanted to leave with like Kate and Eleanor and them. I was hoping that maybe they'd be like, you know what? When she said that your people have to leave, look, I thought they were gonna push Kate and Eleanor and them out too. Like we could find different people or some stuff like that, but I guess not. I gotta tell you, man. Excuse me. I thought you and Kate were, you know. Together? I wouldn't have guessed she was married to. <coughs> not you. I ain't judging, mind you. I'm just curious. What's the story? Ain't um, my business, I know. But what have we got to lose out here? Uh, okay. I... Hey, man, it's all right. Go for it. I mean, it's not like he's with I do have David. Him, Maybe I shouldn't, but that doesn't just make him go away. Right. Uh, no harm in saying it. Hell, only real harm's in not saying it when you should. It's always a mess, ain't it? What's yeah, but, that? I mean, my brother's alive now. Who loves you? If they're one and the same or otherwise... You know what I mean? <laughs> Just when you think you got everything figured out. And you're right, goddamn mess. And it never <laughs> quite washes out. I know Eleanor told you that she and I were... whatever we were, but... that's over now. He's like the good version of Kimmy. I respect her wishes. I really do. I just wish my heart respected mine. Aww. Jesus got his eye on something. 
I mean, Jesus always tries to find a way for you. Listen. Tell me that isn't what I think it is. About a quarter mile out. Heading the same way we are. But we could hit walkers any second. We better scoot. Man, oh man, this is a little... This is a little nerve-wracking. Because even though they're slow, if they come in groups, it can be dangerous. Okay. And I don't want to lose Look anybody. People. I got you got a whole bat! Ooh. Okay, Jesus! That's a little... Alright. that he's kind of mm, right he has a mask oh, he fuck did. Face. come on man move your ass um you want a piece of this i don't think we should waste our time here too I know y'all didn't just look at me without like checking to make sure I was okay. Oh, Jesus. That's that itty bitty thing you push you down. Like, that's what I don't get. Oh no, we lost the bat. Oh. Careful with this. Hey, you. Where I'm just happy now? she's okay. I thought you were getting out of here. I was. The walkers are everywhere. I had to cover myself in walker guts to get away. Come on. We're heading to a factory nearby. Should be safe. I thought you were going to Richmond. The new we frontier kick you out. Doesn't surprise me. Not one bit. No thanks to David. And no thanks at all. David? That asshole's still around? This is gonna sound really weird, but he's my brother. What? <laughs> Wait, this place we're going? David sent you there? It's supposed to be safe. Clem. Well, at least they found her. Oh, you God, please can't don't. trust him, Javi. Why, though? I learned that the hard way. I never wanted to need people again. But I had nowhere else to go. The New Frontier gave me this and made me one of them. They promised they'd help him. That turned out to be a lie. Wait, who's him? Oh no, did something happen to AJ? Oh, I would be- I would be freaking angry. Ava and I run this unit together back in the army. And uh, believe it or not, I know- I'm gonna get you the medicine you need, AJ. I don't care what they say. Oh no, please don't tell me they did something to AJ. Cause we sure didn't see anybody that looked like him in that camp. Huh? Oh no, they got a sick one too. See, this is uh, this is where it come, where it gets hard. I think that was a bad idea. I think we should come to him. You have to be quiet. No way that they didn't hear that though. Huh. Here it is. I picked the right one. Oh, I was I was just guessing. It would have to be a shot. <clears throat> oh well, uh 
I feel bad because I don't want to take their stuff either, but AJ's sick. Shit. Hang in there, goofball. This is gonna get you better. No, well, don't do it here, Clem. This is the one thing I would have, like, waited on. Clem. Oh. Dr. Lingard, what's the matter with you? Um. I'm fine. Clem, please don't. The vancomycin. That's the last of it. It'll be wasted on AJ. I told you. It could save someone's life if used right. It's too valuable to throw away. No, it's, it's the only thing that can save him. <laughs> you can't. I'm sorry, Clem. I tried everything. I... I really did. This will help him get better. Nothing can help your boy now. Wait, oh, so... Clem, put the drugs back before anyone finds out you took them. You know what they do to thieves here. No! I have to try. It's for AJ. Come on, goofball. I need you to be brave for me now, okay? Shh, shh. See? It's not so bad. No, he's gonna cry. This is gonna be bad. Hey, Jay. Shh. What the hell is this? I told her it was a bad idea. Are you fucking high again? Pull yourself together before the others see you. Deal with the damn kid. What the fuck were you thinking? You were told those drugs couldn't help him. Did you think I would just give up on him? AJ is everything to me, David. I'd do anything to keep him alive. Except there's nothing left to do. No. That waste. That'll cost someone's life down the road. Someone in this camp. Someone who contributes to our survival. Come on, David. She was just trying to help her kid. We helped enough. We should have left him out in the woods a week ago. But look, you're it's a helping. monster. It doesn't work that way, Clem. You bought him a peaceful moment. <laughs> Nothing more. I wish I could tell you it would save him. But that's the reality. Then it was worth it. I'd do it again in a heartbeat. Without a goddamn thought for anyone else. We opened our arms to you. Made you one of us. This is how you repay us? By stealing? By putting yourself before the group? You're done here. You broke our rules, Clem. Violated our trust. There's no place for you in the New Frontier. You know what? Fuck you. And fuck the New Frontier. You already did. That's why you have to go. Didn't want to be in this group Maybe anyway. we should give her another chance. Don't fight me on this, Paul. You know what Joan would say if she were here. I'm sorry, Clem. You brought this on yourself. Come on, AJ. We don't need this place anyway. Uh-uh. He stays. What? Can't take him with you. That ship has sailed. Get out of my fucking way. Right now. Clem. He's in no condition to travel. Let him go, Clem. He'll only drag you down out there. No. No! You monsters! They took AJ from me. What about uh, this? <clears throat> what was it all for? Don't forget, I'm one of you. Not anymore. Let her say goodbye. We owe her that much, at least. Fine. You heard her. Say what you need to say, then you go. Please don't make me regret this. Really, Clem? <laughs> You're a piece of work. You know that? You deserve everything you get. I didn't like y'all anyway. The fact that y'all would throw... What, 13, 14 year old out AJ there? It would be the one. Finally. The one what? The one who didn't die. Oh, Clem. My little goofball. He 
didn't deserve it. I survived. I'm so mad. Wait, I thought there was another game after Just this. Go sometimes. I'm so mad. <clears throat> I'm furious with this whole entire game. <laughs> I want this is out. David circled on the map. Our smelly friends are back. I promise AJ better be alive. Is he just expecting you to just just clear them out? You know we're we make a good team, honestly. Come on everybody, come on in. No, wait, what's my trip? <laughs> Isn't he still out there? If too many of them push against this, it might give. Gotta find a way in. Definitely need to find a way. Why did he run that way? Um. Here they come. I can. Fuck. And I can raise it a little, but I don't know, something's wrong with it. Jammed or some shit. Maybe we I can mean, force it open. I mean, we could try the door. We're gonna have maybe, to. Like, one or two people else could help. Maybe, you know, uh, oh wait, listen. I don't hear anything in there. Good enough for me. Come on, man. This thing ain't as strong right, as all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, 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 sorry. I just need to know if anything was in here. Locked. Shit. Look for another way in. It's our only chance. Hey, guy. Pick up the pace, homie. Uh, uh. Well, there's a car. That door holds him. <clears throat> you guys hear humming? Maybe some. Hey, I'm here, David. Oh no! Don't you dare let that fucking baby killer in. <gasps> Clem, don't make me do this. Clem, don't do it, Javi. Hey, open up. He'll die. He deserves worse. Uh, oh no, I did. I was, I didn't see the timer. I know there's a timer in here. I didn't see the freaking timer. I thought you were a good man. We need to barricade the door. Did you let him turn? Tell me. Clementine, no! Don't do Shut this! Shut the fuck up, Javi! We didn't have to worry about that. What the hell does that mean? He lived, Clem. He lived. AJ's alive! I, 
I'm so stupid because I saw the t I didn't see the timer at all. I saw the choices and I was like, I don't, I don't wow. know. I was gonna say she something. Clem said so. AJ bounced back. He was stronger than we thought. It was a miracle. You're lying. I don't know, Clem. I don't think he'd lie about this. You don't know him like I do. Clementine, please, I'm telling the truth. Where? Where is AJ now? I don't know for sure. But he's he in left? Richmond? Dr. Lingard took care of the boy. He'll know how to find him. You guys let him... Then I'm going back. None of us are going anywhere until the walker's clear. You... Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What's your plan, David? We used to store vehicle up this way. Provisions. I came to get you set up. And? And say goodbye. I don't want you to worry about Kate and Gabe. I'll take hey. care of my family from now on. They'll be safe with me. Wait. This is a send-off? You're, you're just seeing me on my merry way. You think I want this? Well, you're not doing much to stop it. I don't see another way. Shit! Port it up. We need something to buffer. Something heavy. There! Help me! I feel bad because I didn't pick anything and now it's like... It's like almost like I was about to let the man die and I wasn't trying to. Wait a half second. Where'd you find this? Over there. Show me. Uh. Um. Property of Prescott? What the hell is all this? Oh my god. Did these could come in handy? Don't want to just take them, but I might be going crazy, but I think these came from Prescott. That's Phantom Punch. I don't understand how all this, this is got all this. Here. This is all the like stuff you from don't Prescott. Know. Hey, none of this stuff was here before. I don't have a damn thing to do with it. We've only ever kept a few basic supplies here for scouts, for emergencies. Whoever did this, they have to be stopped. Damn right they do. Soon as we find out who. Who else knew about this place? Your outfit is the only one that gutted my town. This is bigger than just Prescott. There's spoils from other towns here, too. Towns wow. I heard got raided a while back. There, there's stuff here from the kingdom. I didn't I didn't really think that David had an issue did to this, but Take cover. Oop. I had my hand off the controller. I'd do that little bitch again just to see her head pop. You sure as hell are stupid, ain't you? You only just realizing that now? I told you. Joan is on the warpath. Last thing we need is people getting wind of all this stuff. Look at all this shit. We're freaking rolling in it. I'll give you that. Just glad we found some more smokes. That shit is the new gold. And now we get to see your head pop, you piece of shit. Well, of course, I, I was waiting I to see this guy. Next. I really did. David, come on, man. We're a unit. There's no need for... Um... Why didn't y'all just start shooting at them in the first place? Stop him! He's getting away! I mean, Jesus, if anybody can take care of him, it's Jesus, but you go. definitely gotta go. Get Badger! Oh, he's gonna die. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm going. You're just making it. You just make my decision to murder you so much easier. Oh god, I just the way. This is gonna feel so good. 
<laughs> you murdered his niece. And then you decided to, to fight back. You, you think you deserve to fight back? Um. I tried to grab it! It wouldn't let me grab it! I swear this game sometimes... It's not a play if I don't die. <laughs> this game sometimes be jipping me. Like, I tried to grab it, but like, it takes a second to move. And I don't know if maybe that's on my end or the game's mechanics or something, but it's, it's so frustrating. Oh, you're, gonna, you're, you're really gonna die. I'm glad they didn't change the buttons up either. <laughs> I would have messed up. Like, I'm moving it now. I'm pressing it down now. Okay, it's right there. Um, sir, like, I'm finna let you take that? We're fine up here. Don't come up here. We're fine. You are not to fly my way. If I'd have known you. Okay, now come up here. We're not fine. <laughs> We're not I'd have fine. Shut that gas can down your throat and lit you up like a candle. But this is that is real? Oh God. <laughs> If you can toss one thing, if you aim at the legs, they will fall. Shot a little girl in the face. And even if you didn't do it... You, you, you shook my goddamn guts out. Um, um, fuck. This is for Mariana. She was a sweet little girl. Just minding her own business. And you guys shot her in the face. <laughs> Not anymore. Oh, I'm glad you said that. Thank you. I appreciate it. And fuck you too. I'm so glad you said what you said. This is going to feel so good. I have so much pent up frustration and anger right now. Shut up. Shut. Don't tell Get me. It don't over do. It. With. Come on. What are you waiting for? Just, we just gotta taking move. in the sweet, sweet air. No point drawing it out. We could let him turn. Hold on. No. Let him turn. Let's let him turn. It's only right. <gasps> yeah. Enjoy your life as a zombie. That's gonna feel worse. He's all yours. He might die. Stop. He... Please. Did you Raiding, stop? Looting. You betrayed who we are. You betrayed Richmond. Come on, David. This is Richmond. What's that supposed to mean? Come on. Get the talking. What's that supposed to mean? There's no use holding out, Max. The best you can do is make things right. Mm-hmm. We... we weren't doing it without support inside Richmond. It's the guy. No, it's the girl. Joan it's the lady. was in on it. It's the lady. I knew it. did it on her orders. She... she said we needed it to survive. I wanted to let you in, but she told me you'd never go for it. I'm... I'm sorry. All right. It's too late for sorry, you backstabbing shitbag. Please. Don't kill me. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. I'll help you get back inside. Expose her to the others. <sighs> Maybe he'll be useful. Thank you. Thank you. Maybe we can take him back. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I needed that. <laughs> All right, I gotta stop. <sighs> Don't feel good. 
I'm happy that that guy's gonna turn into a walker. However, I don't feel like I feel like Max was telling the truth as well. So it's better to let him live, cause I would have murdered all of them. I promise you, I would have murdered. Without that information, I probably would have murdered Max. And without seeing this, everybody else probably would have died too. I'm wondering where Clem and Jesus is, because that's got me a little worried. However, right now, I just have to stop.